Hey guys, I'm Simitos Ken. We're about to play some more. I have no mouth yet. I'm going to scream. We are on this dude. I think his name is Nimdok or something like that. Anyway, in the last episode, I think we were we were Benny, and Benny apparently is a really messed up dude who like killed his own men. I think he was a cannibal. I'm not too sure really, but um, we had to show compassion because we we're apparently a very very cool person. But anyway, now we'll be this dude. Nimdok, you are kindred spirit to me. Even if you don't realize it fully yet, you must sense it there in your blood and fiber. I've constructed an adventure so as to revive your failing memory. I want you to find the lost tribe of humanity <laughs> and continue your eminent scientific research. Cool, scientific research. I probably have to torture someone. This compound looks familiar. Ah, this compound. But why would Arm bring me here to look for a lost tribe? Good there question. There are gates and fences. Who could be lost in such a secure area? I don't know. Do I got the volume set right? Yep, sure do. All right, continue playing. What's up, dude? I'm going to talk to you. How are you? You must let me leave. I have urgent business elsewhere. I cannot let you pass, Doctor. You're due in surgery. Dr. Mengele's orders. Fair enough. What's up, prisoner? How are you? Why are you imprisoned here? You have the features of a man of intellect. Is this an official interrogation, Nimdok? Or are you mocking me? You know me? I thought I did. Until you had me arrested for refusing to condone your experiments. Uh. Experiments? I know nothing of experiments. Your sense of humor is as sick as your methods, Doctor. How can you act so innocent after having maimed or killed hundreds since the name of science? Uh. You are saying we were colleagues of some kind? Ridiculous. There's no need to distance yourself from me. I was once your friend. Now I am your enemy. Why would I bother to have you imprisoned like this? The regime needed answers, but I stood in your way. Well, now you have them. Do you know of the lost tribe? I must find it. Haven't you taken enough subjects for your experiments, Doctor? Or are there more mass graves to fill? I know nothing of what you talk about. This conversation is over. Yeah, it's over. My gosh. Okay, so hospital door? Let's go to the hospital. Where have you been, Nimdok? We are waiting on you to perform. I don't know. You were waiting for me? I am sorry that I will not be able to assist in the operation. After all, this may be the last opportunity we have together before the end of the war to finish our research. Ah, yes, the research. Let us talk about this research. We will have time for that after the surgery. Meet me at the complex later. Okay, well, what the heck ever. This is just confusing. What's this poster all about? Look at that poster. A youth. With 1945 stamped beneath. 1945. There is something familiar about this. So 1945. That may be important later. I don't know. Uh, let's look at the curtain. Finally. Oh, God. Everyone's waiting on your expertise. Uh. What's that? Look at the ether. It has been a long time since I have seen ether used as an anesthetic. Well, take it. No, take. I'm sorry, Doctor. What? The ether is necessary for the surgery. Oh, the scalpel? The scalpel is coated with dried blood. I doubt that anyone has bothered to sterilize it. Maybe not. Let's take it. Can we take that? Oh, yeah. Get a scalpel. So what's up? The anesthetist, anesthetist, anesthetist is administering ether to the patient. This child... Cannot be more than eight years old. That's not good. What's up, dude? What am I to do? What am I to do? Ah, you are testing me because I'm new here. 
Today's procedure requires the removal of the lower section of the subject's spinal cord. What? What? What is the purpose of such a procedure? You and Dr. Mengel will process the spinal fluid from this and the other adolescent subjects. The fluid will then be used to formulate the serum. What is the nature of this serum? I cannot reveal sensitive regime secrets in such a public setting. You need not worry, Doctor. I remember my military training as well as my medical knowledge. Hmm. Uh... I will begin the procedure momentarily. It will be an honor to work under you, Dr. Nimdok. I think I'm supposed to use the scalpel on this guy's face. Guards, come here quickly. Dr. Nimdok has gone berserk. Stabbed! I must leave before the guards apprehend me. Yeah, it made me happy. Uh, take that. Uh, look at recovery. Okay, let's go in there. Sorry, kid. This must Good be Lord. the recovery room. Patients everywhere? Ah. All right. This patient has been too damaged by his surgery to live a normal life. Okay. This patient will never recover. The patient will never recover. It is difficult to see what purpose this surgery serves other than to mutilate the patient. So we're just chopping people up for fun, huh? Well, that sucks. There is heat coming out of this vent. Let's push the vent. Oh, snap. There is a passage here. Yeah. There is. Oh, God dang it. Just walk through the passage. Come on. How about you use the passage? There I we go. I smell burnt flesh. But this is obviously not a kitchen. Well, that's not good. What is this? A watch? A gold watch. I am surprised it's one of us able to keep it long enough to reach this place. Let's take it. My watch. Pliers. These pliers must be used for extracting gold fillings and teeth from the corpses. Wow. You just, just know that from looking? Look at the records. According to these records, hundreds of corpses were incinerated here. <sighs> Well then, that's pretty um pretty tough. What do these controls do? This lever must be used for setting the oven temperature. That doesn't sound very good. I don't think I'm gonna do that. These ovens are more monstrous than anything Am has ever constructed. Hmm. But this door. Use the door. Hey, back outside. And you're you're new. Use the victim. Well, just, 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 just talk to the victim. Uh... How could you so foolishly be caught in the wires? How could you so foolishly be caught in the wires? I was trying to escape, but I was so weak. I fell and got caught. How do you risk? Why do you risk escaping in such poor physical condition? That timing was hardly of my own choosing. I learned that I was to be among the next batch of volunteers. Oh, volunteers, huh? Uh, I guess let's keep talking so to him. For you being given the privilege to volunteer? Experimentation, they say. Extinction is more like it. Surely you of all people know the regime's plan for the lost tribe. Uh... I will summon one of the doctors. No, I'm better off here than under the knives of you butchers. Hello. There is nothing I can do for you. You can at least help me end my misery. Oh yeah? That would give you the pleasure of seeing another one of us die, you Cold-hearted bastard. So mean. I got some pliers. Maybe I can cut you down. Okay, so uh, I think I'm supposed to actually use the, the this stuff on him. So let's 
Let's use this on the victim. Oh, that feels much better. All right, let's cut him down. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Listen, I heard this in the hospital when the doctor thought I was sleeping. Waken the sleeper, utter the truth, and kiss him. Utter the truth and kiss him. He is free, but he has lost consciousness. Okay, well, he's still up there, but apparently that's how we're supposed to do it. And, alright, let's talk to you. I hope you are happy with the regime that you set up. Your science could have saved the world. Instead, it conquered it. What is the importance of the year 1945? What is the importance of the year 1945? It seems to have some significance. Never forget the year 1945, Nimdok. That was when the truths about you and your unholy experiments came out. I seem to recall that you speak Latin. What is engraved on this watch? The engraving says time is truth. And since your time is running out, I'll keep the watch. <laughs> okay. I am starting to recall that you do have cause to hate me. You want to make amends? Get me out of here. Oh, well, what if I give you these pliers? Can you get yourself out of here? Ha! Here. You should be able to escape with this. Pliers for cutting the wires? Yes, I think this would make escape possible. But don't think that one good deed will make up for all those poor innocents you butchered. Well, whatever. All right, what's next? Let's see. Continue oh. your research. The extinction of the lost tribe is near at hand. The regime shall vanquish all of its enemies. Ah. Hey, you're different. What is this? A jar? Uh, what's up, you? Uh, wow. What have you done to deserve removal of your eyes? Disconnect the wires. Can we disconnect the wires? Uh, use the jar. Or take the jar, maybe. If I take take your jar. No, no. The wires. They burn. Oh, sorry. All right. Uh, use patient. What do you want me to do here? Let's see. The wires. Oh, maybe, oh, maybe I'm supposed to use the ether on him. Because he says it hurts. Here you go, buddy. This should ease your suffering. Yeah, good job, me. I see now. Oh, he's hot. Trinity of three beasts. One like us. One from the east. One from the steppes. They speak in numbers. A lost tribe of our brothers sleeping on the moon. They sleep in darkness, unseen by the beasts. Such a vision, so tiring. I have to rest. Can I take your jar now? Oh, it's got his eyeballs in it. <laughs> All right, what else has changed? Hey! You weren't here before. What's up, dude? How are you feeling? How are you feeling? I feel okay. I'm not hurt like the others here. Do you know who I am? You are Nimdok? You are more frightening in person than in legend. Ah. Oh. What do you know of me? The things you do are terrible. We small ones are your lab rats. Mm. Are you saying that the doctors here have been using children for experimentation? No, not all the doctors. You and Dr. Mengele sent all the good doctors to the prison yard. Prison yard? So, 
I am a legend to you. Yes, but we have our own legends. Legends that owe nothing to your regime. You will fail, no matter how many of us you cut apart. Why do you say that the regime will fail? The Golem will finish you. It will not be mastered by your regime. The Golem will wake up, and when it sees with its own eyes the evil you have yeah, done, have some eyes. it will turn on you and save us. Okay. Now, oh, apparently I did good. Get some rest. Get some you rest. You will not rest until your regime is destroyed. You're a naked baby. Shut up. Okay. Uh... Let's go out. There is a I know there's a patch there. Use it. Am I like <laughs> rubbing my hands together all sinister sinisterly? Sinisterly? Oh snap. There's people. So I think I'm supposed to get a box in here. Emergency. The prisoners have seized the compound. Gather all research materials and evacuate to the bunker. Evacuate. I think that that box has appeared. I think I'm supposed to. Use the jar with the box. It is safely hidden in the box. All right, cool. Now I got a jar in the box. Hot dog. <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's talk to. I don't know, can we talk to these guys? Apparently not. Prisoner. Let's see. Ah. I may be able to remedy the atrocities I've committed. You must let me go. With these materials, I may be able to remedy the atrocities I have committed. You can't fool me, Nimdok. You are an unredeemable butcher. But you are one of us, like it or not. Uh, why do you say that I'm one of you? Why do you say that I am one of you? You denied your heritage and turned your own parents into the regime. But you're still a member of the Lost Tribe. And that makes your crimes all the more heinous. That's crazy. Does that mean you will allow me to go? Since you did help us to escape, we'll give you a head start. Then we'll hunt you down and kill you like the dog you are. Oh, I nice. must leave this place. It seems I was once the wolf. Now, I am the quarry. Are there faces in the wall? What's up with that? Faces. Faces of people in torture. There's bones back there. I have not seen so many corpses since... Ugh, my memory is not what it used to be. Wow. Well, it's going to the bunker, I guess. I know this is that? place. What is that? Some of my greatest accomplishments were made here. Well then, what's all in here? What is this? What is that? The message reads, cease all work on Project Perfect Image. Confidential. The leader is dead. Having looked on the face of the future using the prototype device. This leaves the regime ripe for invasion. Destroy all work in progress. This technology must not be allowed to fall into the hands of the enemy. Well then. That seems like serious business. What else is here? What is bell jar? More for Genesis. Ah. The ability to reorganize DNA at will. Did Am discover my work in this area? Is this how he was able to alter Benny and play other cruel tricks on the rest of us? Maybe. It seems pretty cray, though. Seems pretty cray. What's at this doorway over here? The legends oh. are true. This must be the golem of lost tribe folklore. Snap. What else is around here? Blueprints. This golem appears to be made of steel and molded clay. 
It's a triumph. Really? Such a strange combination of scientific plans and mystic symbols. This has something to do with the golem, but the meaning is not clear. Ah, so I have to learn how to read it. Ah, use that switch. What does that do? Use the vat, maybe? I see a mirror. It was obscured by the light. Oh, take a mirror. Take it. What is this mirror doing? What <laughs> is this mirror doing here? Maybe I have to use the mirror to read the board. I do not know what to do with this. No? Hmm. Well, I mean, I should look at the mirror? Oh, my God. It is true. 1945. Turning my Jewish parents over to the Nazis for extermination. Okay. I have found the lost tribe. It is me. Oh, snap. What? Such a this has okay. <laughs> it's me, apparently. I'm the lost tribe. What the heck ever does that mean? Okay, so I'm gonna use this on the golem. Have some eyeballs, buddy. These eyes fit into the golem sockets perfectly. Hot dog. Let's talk to him. Golem, wake up. Wait, wait, wait. The man caught in the barbed wire said to waken the sleeper, utter the truth, and kiss him. The man caught in the barbed wire said to waken the sleeper. Utter the truth and kiss him. Utter the truth and kiss him. Wait. So, hang on. You put the eyes in the golem. Uh, maybe time is truth. Time is truth. Uh, kiss the golem. Nothing no! Okay, that's not right. Maybe I'm supposed to... Go and wake up. Gollum, wake up. Uh... Oh wait, the truth is that for me, it shall always be... The truth is that for me, it shall always be 1945. Kiss the golem. Ha! Yeah, golem, you're awake. Don't kill me, please. Follow me in the laboratory. You must be all my orders. Uh, f am, am, am I supposed to... I don't know. Follow me in the Follow. laboratory. Follow me into the laboratory. Oh, hey! Himduck, I was afraid I had lost you back there. It is good to see you and our new friend. Yeah, I guess. Uh, talk to. What's up, dude? How'd you escape? Look at the mirror. Ah, yeah, look at the mirror, buddy. I mirror. looked into the mirror. I now remember everything with crystal clarity. The research camps, the serum. Ah, yes, the youth serum. Your research demanded the deaths of many children, but your hard work was successful. Eternal youth for those who deserve it. Wow, really? Uh, how did you escape the mob? How did you escape the mob? Did you forget that the compound has a secret escape route? I guess well, I did. No matter. I see that you have revived the golem. What do you know about the golem? You know about the golem? Of course! Part of the master plan is to strip the lost tribe of everything, even their folklore. Alright. I read the teletype. What is Project Perfect Image? That was a secret project in the area of reflective surfaces. It bestows the clarity to see yourself with utter objectivity. Unfortunately, it worked too well. Hmm. Now I know how Am was able to keep us alive for so many years. Your use serum can sustain us forever. We have all the time we need to resurrect the regime. Huh. 
You mean that it worked well enough to drive the leader into committing suicide? The leader's death is a serious blow to us all, but our golem is more than powerful enough to destroy the lost tribe. <laughs> Excuse me, doctor. I need to get a breath of fresh air. Breath? Hey, use the mirror on him. Make him look at it. Oh my god! Ha! No! That apparently that was good. So, how, how did you feel about that? Dr. Mengele is <laughs> in a state of shock. Okay. Uh, what's up, Golem? Kill him? Oh my gosh. Uh, let's go outside. Golem, follow me outside. I think I actually need to kill him. I mean, he's already in a state of shock. We need to kill himself like the leader. Nimdok. I knew that you would lead us to where the regime would resume its atrocities. We are here to make you pay for what you did to us. To pay in blood. Go and destroy the lost job. Rob the bunker. I will return momentarily. Uh, transfer control. Oh, ah! That seems like the good thing to do. Gollum, I transfer control of you over to the lost tribe. So, you admit your crimes. But that does not release you from punishment. Now the golem will serve the purpose for which it was constructed. Golem, kill Nimdok. Oh, snap! Oh! It popped my head. You're not as alike as I thought, Nimdok. <laughs> the spark of humanity somewhere. Always that wretched little spark. You, you've confronted your past, but you refuse to continue your research. <laughs> That's what I asked you to do. Since you now identify with your victims, I suppose it's only right that I let you experience their tortures, too. Ah, you. You're the last player in my little game. I urge you, do not fail, as the others have failed. Well, that's it for Nimdok, then. I tortured a bunch of people, and apparently everything that Am is doing to us is Nimdok's fault. Like, keeping us alive forever, and changing us, and... Oh well. Anyway, that was, uh, that was Nimdok's story. I hope you enjoyed it, and we'll see you guys next time. Stay toasty, my friends.